I live in a van and work full-time remotely, so a good internet connection is vital. In researching Starlink, one of my concerns was whether it would work in the forest. It's true that Starlink needs a clear view of the sky, and it won't work in a really densely forested area, but we found plenty of dispersed camping sites in national forests that have a clear enough view of the sky for Starlink to function while still giving the feeling of camping among the trees. When we got to this campsite in Bend, Oregon, we set our Starlink up on our roof mount and powered it on. After a few minutes, it got online and we were all set with high-speed internet, even though our cell phones had basically no usable reception. We've been on the road for six months now, and in that time, we've only found two campsites where we couldn't get a reliable connection. When we started van life, we were hesitant about the price of Starlink, so we relied on our T-Mobile phones to hotspot, and we also have a Verizon hotspot, but we could not stay at even half of the campsites that we stay at if we didn't have the Starlink.